So we're going to have a look at switch access to YouTube on Special Bytes. And just to simulate a switch press, we're going to use a little keyboard with a numeral one key or a space bar. First of all, we have to make sure that it's connected to the iPad and uh, we make sure it's turned on. We can go into settings and then into Bluetooth. And then we have Bluetooth mini keyboard and that's connected and that's okay. So if you're connecting a switch box, make sure it's connected before you start. Let's open up a, a web page and have a look down the side here. We can see fun video access. I'm going to go on here. Let's bring it up. Let's have a look. There's uh, activities here. And if I choose one of them, let's say this one. Okay, it's got little instructions along the bottom of the screen. You need to follow these very, very closely. So please alter the seconds to pause. That's the time up here. Um, and it's between 5 seconds and 100 seconds. And then start the video player and wait. What I'm going to do is I'm going to slide my finger across here. So I'm going to give it 5 seconds before it pauses until the switch user has to press again. Okay, now I need to, with my finger, I need to touch the screen to get it all started. So it's going to play for about 10 seconds. Okay, I'm following the instructions down here. Please deal with any ad adverts and touch the button right of the player to make switch accessible. So there's a little button up here. We need to touch that to make a switch accessible. And now we have a go button down here. And now if I go back to my keyboard and press the space to simulate a switch press, it will now play for five seconds. It will stop. Let's just press the, the numeral one key. Now what is very, very important is that if you touch the screen at any point now, it will disable the switch access. So assuming you've set it up at the beginning, just leave the screen and the control is completely with the switch user. So now I'm back to my space bar again or numeral one key, simulate the switch press, play again for five seconds. So then I go, go back. It'll play to the end and then it will start all over again. Switch user being completely in control if the screen is not touched. So you can do the rest. I'll just click on this one. Show the process again. You can alter the time here at the beginning. So five seconds until pause. You might want to leave that at 20. And then I press the play button. Oops, I'm not sure I did at that time. Press the play button. Plays for 10 seconds. And then it pauses. Now to make it switch accessible, we touch this button up here. And now it's over to the switch user. So to simulate the switch uh, press, we're going to do press the space here. And so it's playing for five seconds. It stops or pauses until the switch user presses again. So we'll close that. So the very important thing about uh, playing these is that when you set up the switch access is not to touch the screen again. Just leave it uh, in control with the switch user. And that's the switch access to YouTube on specialbytes.com.